फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर सुरजीत घोष वेलकम टू माई चैनल डॉक्टर घोष प्रेजेंट साइन सिम्टम्स एंड यूजेस ऑफ होमियो रेमेडी फाइटोलक्का फुल नेम फाइटोलक्का डेकांड्रा शॉर्ट नेम फाइटोलक्का आई विल यूज दिस नेम थ्रू आउट द वीडियो कॉमन नेम पोक रूट सोर्स प्लांट वेजिटेबल वर्ल्ड जस्ट माइंड वन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सेइंग ऑफ डॉक्टर जेम्स टेलर केंट ही सेड दैट फाइटोलक्का कुड बी कॉल्ड वेजिटेबल मार्करी लाइक पोटोफाइलम एंड मेजेरियम यू नो मार्करी इज ए मेडिसिन ऑफ केमिकल वर्ल्ड and it's a very deep acting very wide medicine big medicine kent says the phytolacca is equal to mercury in vegetable world same deep acting same deep and wide spheres of action of phytolacca acts mainly upon glandular system particularly on the throat and mammary glands mind it mammary glands it affects also serous fibrous mucous tissues pathogenesis phytolacca causes inflammation and irritation of serous fibrous and mucous tissues skin periosteum on glandular system it brings ulceration constitution of phytolacca physical makeup of phytolacca emaciated chlorotic hypocritic face now what is hypocritic face look this face is hypocritic face this type of face the whole eye i mean the whole face is sunken the bones are Im Im clearly visible just coming out of the surface eyes are deeply set in the eyeballs and looks exhausted highly prostrated myasms phytolacca psychotic syphilitic note both the most complex type of myasms psychotic syphilitic both are here is phytolacca hot or chilly very chilly dathis phytolacca rheumatic and gouty dathisis general mental generals of phytolacca loss of personal delicacy apathetic indifference to exposure her person complete slimlessness that is the patient especially ladies maybe gents also here it is ladies the symptoms has come from uh, ladies world so it is given her uh, her this is in her parts person means here indifference to exposure person means private parts she is so shameless out of disease mind is disease condition he is not normal he is abnormal because he is in diseased condition and this disease condition has snatched out the personal delicacy we have got all our personal delicacy that is lost he is apathetic he is indifference to exposure of person complete shamelessness there is no shame in her Uh, attitude in difference to life disgust for business great fear that she will die surely feels faint on rising refuses foods in spite continuous insistence physical general of phytolacca a long real long and deep acting remedy phytolacca exerts its prominent action on glands especially mammary glands and tonsils mammary glands sensitive sore fissured pain radiates from nipples all over the body it has also a powerful action on the muscles of neck and back on fibrous tissue on tendons joints osseous tissues periosteum throat and digestive tract soreness and hard aching all over with restlessness and prostration are guiding symptoms sudden aching all over body in eyeballs kidneys neck shoulders back forearms and below knees spreading electric shock like pain come suddenly go suddenly change places worse from motion at night hard and painful nodes hard and painful nodes in various parts of the body maybe especially on the uh, soft area like breasts mammary glands etc alternate spasm and relaxation of muscles tetanus general muscular rigidity discharges shady stringy stringy pass watery fetid icuras syphilitic bone pains retarded dentition rheumatism after tonsillitis modalities of phytolacca worse exposure to damp cold weather or changes of weather raging up motion swallowing hot drinks heat cold night during menses rain stepping down from high steps in all these 
various condition positions and situations the patient feel worse better lying on abdomen or left side rest dry weather head symptoms of fatigue vertigo on rising picture one see this lady he is feeling vertigo sudden rising i am from sitting to standing up pain from frontal region backwards brain feel sore head as if beaten pain comes every time it rains nausea headache better from eating but return soon with vomiting which increases headache but decreases nausea is vomiting increases headache but decreases nausea i symptoms fight lakka smarting with lacrimal fistula lacrimal fistula in picture 2 i will show it's a very uh, short fine picture i will describe everything let me read first out read out profuse warm lacrimation eyeballs ache on reading writing motion of one eye only independent of the other very peculiar symptom motion of one eye only independent of the other generally both our eyes work simultaneously when in diseased condition the motion of eye only one while the other one is fixed orbital cellulitis leads as if on fire ear symptoms fatal occur pain in both ears worse when swallowing now let us uh, explain this picture see this is the uh, eye eye has got uh, eye is always washed with water that is tears and that tears comes out from eye in the nasolacrimal duct this is the nasolacrimal duct and uh, there are two fine channel is are called lacrimal canaliculi through this lacrimal canaliculi tears comes out in the each side of nose and coming in the nostrils it evaporates out this is going on continuously continuously now sometimes this lacrimal duct has some uh, abnormal opening this abnormal opening are called fistula this one one fistula is opening is this another is this this two are fistulas opening fistula means unnatural opening unnatural you can see this just below the eyes fine dot or beside your nose fine nose of the patient fine dot where from tips of water or pus like thing coming out that is opening of the fistula you have to look for it carefully then you, you can see it no symptoms of fatigue occur feels heavy flow from one nostril while other is dry alternately there is some, sometimes left one is dry right one is flowing the other time the reverse acrid coryza coryza means water from nose face symptoms of fatigue occur yellow is sickly face that is already shown aching in malar bone the malar bone is this bone this these two bones are called malar bone the lady is showing his malar bone one picture one is gland swollen at the angle of jaw angle of jaw gland swollen actually this is parotiditis that's coming to later on i will come here jaws ache as in as in mumps lips inverted but firm chin draws close to sternum this is sternum bone this is sternum in front of the chest the chin is coming near to chin, uh, this bone close the chin coming close to sternum mums picture 3 this boy is suffering from mum this is a submandibular gland is there you know we have got uh, each pair of three types of sub, uh, salivary glands the first one is submandibular then sublingual then uh, parotid this is parotid the in front of in front of uh, your uh, ears the parotid gland inflammation of parotid gland is called parotiditis and that is actually palm mumps and parotiditis are the same thing firstly i have spelling submandibular not this is parotid gland parotid gland is here submandibular ears sublingual is below tongue so parotiditis or mumps are same thing mouth symptoms fatal occur desire to press the teeth above and below together difficult dentition tongue fiery red at tip feels burnt pains at root remain protruded the tongue remain protruded 
much stringy saliva very painful small ulcer on sides of cheek cannot chew on that side on that side means where this ulcers are throat symptoms of phytolacca follicular pharyngitis heart throbbing in right tonsil squingy tonsil swollen that i have shown in the first picture swollen tonsil dark throat dark red puffy while great spots on fossis fossis is actually uh, a structure of throat very painful when swallowing cannot swallow anything warm sensation as if hot ball or lump in the throat stomach symptoms of phytolacca violent vomiting and with retching vomiting every few minutes hunger soon after eating easy vomiting without nausea pain worse from deep breathing abdomen symptoms of phytolacca heavy aching in hypochondrium hypochondrium i have shown the nine quadrants here you please check here hypochondrium in the lower portion of this where uh, nine quarters are there there are nine quarters of abdomen you must know this names and areas i have shown it several times before yet i have given a picture here please check yourself heavy pain aching pain in hypochondrium what's lying on affected side better from leucorrhea chronic hepatitis continuous urges for stool even in sleep cancer of rectum constipation of the aged and those with weak heart diarrhea after limonade dysentery passage of mucus and blood is too lonely common symptom of dysentery respiratory symptom of hypochondria panting breathing hoarseness cough with burning in trachea urinary symptoms of hypochondria hard aching in kidney with scanty dark urine and sub or suppressed urine albuminuria albuminuria means actually coming out of albumin in urine generally urine should not contain albumin the kidney will retain the albumin while filtering blood he will retain i mean the kidney will retain albumin if it is normal if it is unhealthy this diseased condition then albumin will come into urine and that is a very diseased condition if urine is uh, albumin is leaked out then your protein is losing that is very dangerous this thing or disease this is called albuminuria and phytolacca is one of the medicine to stop this albuminuria urine on standing gives chalky sediment neck and back symptoms phytolacca next stiff aching pain in lumbar and sacral region here the whole spinal cord is there this is cervical this is thoracic this is lumbar and the lower one this is is written there it is uh, lower portion is coccyx this is sacral this is lumbar T total spinal cord is is total life spine structure is there cord is something else cord is running within this structure that is spinal cord this is spine bone actually so uh, neck and back symptoms next tip taking pain lumbar sacral region pain up and down along the spine this through the spine pain runs up and down male genital symptoms phytolacca spermatic cord sore this is the spermatic cord the spermatic cord by which the testicle keeps hanging within scrotum this cord is actually made up of three or four things number one nerves number two lymphatic number three blood vessels and finally vas deferens which carries the sperm generated in the testicles all this structure is called spermatic cord you can feel it with your own high, um, hand if you are a male person uh, if you check your testes you will see something like uh, fine uh, slippery structures are running from this Uh, testicle upward that slippery and uh, not only there are maybe three four type of slippery cords lying going going above this is spermatic cord shooting along perineum to penis perineum is the space between 
uh, anal orifice and the root of the genitalia in each person I mean in male or female the root of the genitalia and perineum and uh, sorry uh, the orifice of um, uh, anus this is called perineum one inch or two inch places one and one and a half inch uh, area is called perineum this is a very hypersensitive area painful hardening of testicles heart symptoms of fatalaka fatty heart pain leaves heart and goes to right arm shocks of pain in cardiac region female genital syndrome fatalaka heavy heart swollen tender mammy pain in mammy during suckling spreads all over that is baby sucking mammy and pain from the nipple radiates all over the body nipples cracked sore inverted irritable breast before during menses now inversion of what is inversion see this is the inversion of nipple this is healthy nipple this is flat nipple this inversion that is the nipple is not seen it is deep inside the um, uh, areolar tissue and this inversion means so many serious disease acute mastitis tuberculosis cancer of breast and paget's disease there is cancer of areolar tissue all this can result inversion inversion or sorry inversion hard nodes in breast with enlarged axillary glands this menorrhea in barren women with erosion of cervix this is erosion of cervix galactoria galactor means abnormal abnormal oozing abnormal oozing from uh, nipple bloody watery discharge from maybe extremity symptom fatalaka right arm numb fuzzy pain stiffness in right shoulder with inability to raise the arm painful hard shiny swelling of finger joints pain flies like electric shock hips and thighs pain on change of weather aching and weakness in right humerus worse on motion and extension aching in tibia in heels better from elevating feet neuralgia of toes sharp cutting drawing pains in hip legs drawn up cannot touch floor painful hard shiny swelling shiny swelling of the finger joints kin symptom of fatalaka dry harsh shriveled disposition to boils picture 1 venereal bubus picture 2 warts picture 3 lipoma tumor of fat number picture 4 corns barbers each corns picture 5 corn barbers is picture 6 and ringworm picture 7 complementary medicine silesia related medicine cali bicromicum cali iod mercurius rastox with this the video ends thanks for listening and viewing you got any problem please write down in the comment section i would respond certainly